Why do you attend ITEC? ITEC is a place where people from all of our state come together to discuss tech integration. And I attend because not only do I learn from the sessions that uh, I participate in, but the conversations that spill into the hallway and even you know, the dinner conversations that happen afterward um, are inspiring and thought provoking. So this is where our people are. I mean, this is where you know, we, all, we all get re-energized by being together. So um, without that, it, would, you know, it, uh, it, it makes for a great year. I think my favorite part is how much choice there is. You know, every time slot you've got 15 different uh, you know sessions you can choose from. Um, so you can look for you know presenters that you like to hear from, or maybe specific topics that you want to hear more about. And then there's tons of opportunity to collaborate and talk about um, with people that were in your session or maybe went to a different session. So there's just a wealth of information, and you have a lot of choice as to what you want to try to take in. Um, it's a great place to learn a lot of different tips. Um, I spend a lot of time just feeling like I get all this information and then I go back and look over what was presented and really feel like I get a good chance to learn a lot of new things that I can use at our school and in the library. Um, welcome to my personal favorite part of our conference where we get to honor some Iowans for doing amazing things with kids over the past school year. So our first award is for Aaron Maurer. Aaron is our 2018 recipient of the ISTE Making It Happen Award. Aaron is currently serving as the STEM lead for Mississippi Bend AEA and is the founder of a nonprofit called 212 STEAM Labs, Inc. Prior to this, he served as an instructional coach for Bettendorf Middle School. He has been in education for over a decade, teaching sixth grade social studies, literature, and computer, as well as spending many years teaching gifted ed in grades four through eight before taking on the new role of instructional coach. Aaron is a former Le first Lego League coach, and he's also a member of the Lego Education Advisory Panel. He is an avid fan of STEAM, maker spaces, and project-based learning. In his free time, he loves to spend time with his three kids and his wife, as well as his bulldog, Frankie Mae. Last, Aaron is an avid coffee consumer and can frequently be spotted in a bow tie searching for that perfect cup of joe. Congratulations, Aaron, and we're excited to have you as our Making It Happen Award recipient. Our next two recipients, I'll have Nancy and Cindy step up. Nancy is our award recipient of the Local Technology Leadership Award. Nancy has been in business education and technology teacher for Kemper Catholic High School since July 1999. In addition to her role of classroom teacher, her work responsibilities include 612 integration specialist, K-12 IT assistant, coordinator of STEM innovate, innovator instructor. She shares her passion for learning and technology by supervising the high school tech club, 
school newspaper, and social media in the Middle School Hyperstream Club. Nancy is currently working with coworkers to ensure technology and STEM activities are incorporated in every content area, K-12, by developing a documented set of opportunities to enhance and engage students in real-world skills. Thank you, Nancy, to your contributions. And our final recipient today is Cindy Heron. Cindy is the award winner for our Outstanding Educator Award and is the K-12 Technology and Innovation Leader for Waukee Schools. She enjoys helping both students and teachers to creatively use technology tools to extend and share their learning in meaningful and practical ways. Previously, she taught in very various elementary and technology classrooms. Cindy is also an Apple Distinguished Educator and a PBS Lead Digital Innovator, as well as a Code.org Fundamentals Facilitator. She has served on the Iowa Computer Science Education Workgroup, the Computer Science Re Standards Review Team, and the Governor's Computer Science and Elementary Advisory Group. She is passionate about bringing the opportunity to learn computer science to every Iowa student. Thank you, Cindy. Thank you all for your contributions as well as our award winners. Don't forget that you can nominate award winners before the fall iTech conference each year. And thank you for everything that you do.